Hey, what's up? This is Paul. So you may have seen videos with outlines like this, or you may have seen YouTube thumbnails with outlines like this. Here's one of mine here. Um, you can actually see that I did this the other day. In fact, I'm starting to do this in a lot more of my videos because I actually did this one yesterday. There's a Facebook post and it's got super engaged. I think it makes it really stand out and it's really striking. And you've probably tried to have a go at doing this in something like Canva and it's not been that easy, right? Or you've, you know, you've tried doing it. So what I'm gonna, what I've decided to do today is to uh, make a video showing you. We do use, we do need to use a couple of tools. Two of them are free. One of them is paid. Um, but it, by combining these tools, we can make these amazing thumbnails. So the first one is Canva. Obviously, I'll, I'll put all of these uh, resources available in the description. The next one is Remove.bg, which is going to take our image and remove the background. And then we're going to, I'm actually using to make the outline, I'm actually going to use Photoshop, which is a premium tool. However, you can obviously um, use your own premium tool if it's got a stroke feature, because that's the only feature we're going to be using. So it's going to be super fast and we're going to get cracked straight on. So the first thing is we want an image, right? We want an image that we want to use. So this is, um, so we're going to get rid of all of this. Okay, so we're just going to remove all of this. Okay, and we're just going to have a background here so that we've, you know, this is our blank canvas. Now, if you're coming in Canva and you want to get a blank canvas, obviously you just go to background. You can just choose whatever you want. Okay, you can do a color, you can do, you know, one of these, whatever you want. Okay, and if you're doing this for a YouTube thumbnail, before you start, when you actually go to create a new design, you can go to um, templates here, just put in YouTube and then it will have YouTube thumbnail okay so you could start with that right so i'm i'm basically starting with this i actually really like that color um especially with a white background that's going to be really striking it's going to stand out so we're going to start with that um so the first thing we want to do is grab our image now i have actually what i quite often do is this is one of my courses I actually quite often just grab a screen grab of one of my images right now although that doesn't look massively clear this is, it's not going to be this big, remember, it's going to be a lot smaller. So we could just move that around, but you'll see that this is, I'm quite animated when I talk, so it is slightly blurry. But having said that, uh, let's get something fun. Let's get something funny that we can work with. Uh, that is quite funny, but let's do that. <laughs> so yeah, it looks like a bit like a horror movie, but there you go. So we're just going to grab that and then that goes in. And then what we're going to do is we're going to head over to remove.bg and we're literally just going to straight away upload that. And that's going to give us, that's going to remove the background. Okay. Now this does have an editing feature. So if it doesn't remove all the background or you need to edit a bit like that f finger there looks a bit weird. Okay. So we can actually go edit. Okay. We can zoom in a bit to that finger, um, let's zoom out a little bit, and then we can get this erase bit here, we can change the brush size and we can just remove that little bit around my finger. You know, if you, if, if, you know, if you just need to do a little bit of touch up editing, you can do. Okay, so that, you know, that'll be fine because it's gonna be for a thumbnail for an image anyway. So, uh, and then what we would do is we would download the image. Okay, actually, um, what I might do is just get rid of some of these hairs because we want the outline to look quite funky. And maybe just keep some at the top. So just get that slightly there, there we go. So we're gonna download the image and then that is ready to go. And then all we need to do with that image is go and upload it to go to Photoshop. Now we're not gonna see the outline on this if we do it white pretty much because we can see there isn't a background. But what we wanna do is just go to edit and go to down to um, stroke there we go and i have mine at the moment set to 7px and white now and you want to make sure you clip outside right so you can make it slightly smaller if you want at the moment i'm loving seven so i'm going to do seven you can probably just about make that outline out right and then what we're going to do is we're going to go file and we're going to go uh export as quick export as png because we're putting it into canva right so i'm just going to call it me demo Okay, and we're going to go save. And you can see that doesn't look quite so blurred now. Um, and then the last thing we want to do is just go straight over to Canva. Okay, and we're going to go to uploads. And then we're just going to drop it in. Okay, and this is now an image in my thumbnail. So I may have, 
I would not normally have two images of me, but you know, you may have something there and then you may have, you know, some other funky stuff that you're doing in your images. I can't think of anything that we've got. Uh, there was an image there, no ads. So that could be a thumbnail, for instance. That's probably not one I'm going to use. But as you can see, that's not quite as blurry as it looked when we had it. Um, super massive. And that's it, guys. That's all you need to do. And you can obviously do it for ads. You can do it for all sorts of things that you've got. Um, so, yeah, um, please subscribe to the channel. Obviously, hit the bell if you want to be notified of all my upcoming training. And if you want to find out how to place your thumbnails and your products and services on the front page of Google for free, then there is a link in the description to go and get my completely free five-step formula, my, my training, and you can actually go and watch that immediately or watch it a bit later, whatever you want. So the link's in the description, and I'll see you guys in the next video.